Well, we were contacted um, about a year ago now by a, a company called Off the Fence Productions. They were, uh, they are an extremely uh, famous company. They produced a film on Netflix called My Octopus Teacher, which a lot of people have watched. And they were basically explaining that you know they were doing this film about underground spaces around the world, and that they'd chosen Gibraltar um, to be one of the five places they were visiting. They've visited places like Slovenia, Belize, China, Great Britain and Gibraltar. And they wanted to, you know, look at different underground spaces. Gorham's Cave was part of it, but they also had an interest in some of the other sites, some of the other caves that we have here in Gibraltar. So could, just tell us about filming. What, what do they think when they went down there? I've seen a preview on yeah. Instagram, what yeah. they've posted, and there's a gentleman who gets stuck under the cave, yeah. and it all looks quite extraordinary. Yeah. I mean, they were an amazing film crew. We've, we've fortunately worked with many film crews in the past. These guys were extremely professional. We were actually with them for a, a month filming here in Gibraltar. Most of that time spent underground. Um, we did Gorham's Cave uh, was one of them. They did uh, the Stay Behind Complex as well. And we also took them to see uh, inside St. Michael's Cave, the Leonora's system, and especially the Ragged Staff system or the Silent Pool and we got special permission. Um, they brought over John Belanthan. He was an extremely uh, famous cave diver. He's considered one of the best in the world. He was in fact the man that saved these 12 uh, school children in Thailand. And it was because he was coming that he, the, he was given permission um, and dived to the depths of the silent pool, something that not many people had done before. Um, and it was extremely interesting. I mean, working with these top professionals, Rue Walters, who was the man doing all the scanning uh, of the caves, um, and it was an absolute experience, really. It sounds incredible, and we get to see all of this on Curiosity Stream. Yeah. Um, some may not have heard of that yeah. before. What can you tell us? So Curiosity Stream is, is uh, it's a platform similar to Netflix. In fact, you just download it in the same place you would download Netflix on your television. It's all about documentaries. They have 20 million subscribers at the moment, so th this is really giving a lot of publicity to Gibraltar and, and the work that we do here in, in Gibraltar and some of these amazing places that we go to. Um, talking about all this publicity, I mean, are you finding that there's increased publicity and, uh, well, that's generating more interest uh, in Gibraltar in the work that you're doing here? We've had a lot of uh, different companies that, that we've worked with in the past, BBC, National Ge Geographic and so on, we have noticed an increase uh, in the past year. I don't know if COVID affected that and, you know, people wanted to work um, at the moment there was a little break. But yeah, we, we had Curiosity Stream, Netflix, National Geographic, BBC, amongst others last year. And um, yeah, I can say that there are other companies that we're working with at the moment uh, in 2022.